टेन साइंस एंड सिम्टम्स दैट यू आर डेफिशेंट इन जिंक ओवर टू बिलियन पीपल वर्ल्ड वाइड आर डेफिशेंट इन जिंक विच कैन लीड टू हेल्थ प्रॉब्लम सच एज हेयर लॉस डिप्रेशन इंडिजेस्टन एंड मैनी अदर्स टू डिफाइन इट जिंक इज एन इसेंशियल ट्रेस मिनरल दैट द बॉडी कैन नॉट मेक ऑन इट्स ऑन so we have to eat it regularly from certain foods although we only need tiny amounts of zinc on a daily basis 11 mg for men and 8 mg for women but it still perform thousands of different functions such as stabilizing dna and rna which is the genetic material found inside your cells it also helps hundreds of enzymes to build proteins like skin hair nails and hormones Zinc also helps in building immune cells which are white blood cells army that protect you from viruses bacteria and many other invaders that can harm you Unfortunately a blood test will not tell you if you have deficient in zinc as most of the zinc in your body is not stored in the blood it's stored in your cells So in today's video I want to share the top 10 common signs of zinc deficiency that you can become aware Afterwards I also explain the causes of zinc deficiency and how to fix it so that you can maintain a healthy overall body. Just a quick reminder this video is for educational purposes only so do speak to a doctor if you have any genuine medical concerns. The first and very common sign of zinc deficiency is loss of taste and smell. Your body uses zinc to send signals to your brain from your taste buds and from your nose so that you can perceive different tastes and smells. But if you don't have enough zinc inside your body, food starts becoming bland and tasteless and smells lose their potency. This usually happens after someone has had a cold or an infection from the virus because the body uses its zinc to fight off the infection and there is not enough zinc left for your taste and smell receptors. The second sign is white spots on the nails. Your nails take around 3 to 6 months to grow out. So if you notice that there is a white spot in the middle, this means that you had a zinc deficiency a few months ago. This is usually caused by eating lots of refined carbohydrates and sugar which depletes your zinc and usually causes these white spots to appear. As zinc is needed to produce healthy and strong keratin for your nails. People with a more severe deficiency may also develop white horizontal lines across their nails from left to right. The third symptom is depression. People who suffer with clinical depression usually have low levels of zinc. Basically, zinc is needed to build neurotransmitters and hormones in the brain like dopamine, which makes you feel pleasure and happiness. But without enough zinc, your brain chemistry becomes out of balance and mood disorders like depression, anxiety and bipolar disorder can arise. The fourth sign is low testosterone. As men get older, the amount of testosterone they produce gets lower and lower. Zinc however helps the body to keep producing normal level of testosterone and prevents it from being converted into other hormones like estrogen or DHT. Men with a zinc deficiency may suffer with shrinking testicles, weakness of muscles, poor sperm quality and prostate enlargement. As a side note, I'll be talking about some foods later in the video that you can use to boost up your zinc intake to prevent all of these problems. The fifth symptom is thinning hair. If you notice that your hair is becoming thinner or you're getting bald patches in your scalp, this could be caused by a zinc deficiency. Zinc is involved with building DNA, proteins and hormones that are important for producing strong, thick and healthy hair. Zinc also helps your gland to make sebum, the natural oil that moisturizes your skin and scalp and prevents dandruff. If you're finding this information useful, please hit the like button, subscribe and turn all notifications on to stay updated for my latest health and nutrition tips. So coming back right to the symptom number 6 which is frequent infections. Having a cold or infection every few months is not normal. If you do, it means you have a weakened immune system which could be caused by a zinc deficiency. Zinc supports the thymus gland where your T cells are created. These are part of your immune system which helps to fight off viruses, bacteria and fungi before they can do harm to your body. So moving to the sign number 7 which is vision problems. 
A zinc deficiency can cause you to struggle to see in low light conditions at night because it's needed to transport vitamin A from the liver to your eyes. It also helps to build visual pigments in your retinas so that you can see clearly, sharply and with color. So if you don't have enough zinc, you are far more likely to suffer with night blindness, dry eyes, cataracts and macular degeneration. The symptom number 8 is stomach and mouth ulcers. If you suffer with gastric, peptic, stomach ulcers or mouth ulcers, then this is the positive sign that you are deficient in zinc. Getting more zinc into your diet helps to repair the damaged tissues and the inner skin of the body, preventing ulceration in the future. Symptom number 9 is shortness of breath. If you climb up a set of stairs, take a light walk or exert yourself and you quickly find that you are out of breath very easily. This can also indicate a zinc deficiency. Because zinc is involved with making antioxidants that protect your heart so that you can have oxygen-rich blood. Without enough zinc and other antioxidants like vitamin E, your heart may become weaker, your blood pressure can go up and you may have air hunger when you perform physical activity. Symptom number 10 is skin problems. Zinc plays an important role in the production of collagen. This is a structural protein that holds your skin together, keeping it smooth, flexible and healthy. Without enough zinc, pregnant mothers and those who gain weight are far more likely to develop stretch marks because the skin loses its elasticity. Low zinc can also cause the skin to start cracking and having a glazed appearance often around the falls of mouth, hands and groin. You may also develop acne, eczema, dermatitis and other issues. Later in the video, I'll talk about how to replenish your zinc if you have any of these signs and symptoms. But first, let's look at the 5 main causes of zinc deficiency. Number 1. The first and most common cause of zinc deficiency is eating too many sugary foods like biscuits, soda drinks, fruit juices, jams, syrups and sweets. Your body uses up its zinc stores to help turn sugar into fuel. So if you eat too much sugar, your zinc stores get depleted. Number 2. You can be deficient in zinc because you have digestive damage and are not absorbing it properly. If you have IBS, Crohn's disease, diverticulitis, IBD or you have had a gastric bypass, this will prevent you from absorbing enough zinc so you may need a supplement to boost your intake. Number 3. Another cause of low zinc is drinking too much alcohol, which blocks zinc from being transported to your organs properly. Number 4. Also boiling your vegetables or meats can cause the zinc to leach out into the water and escape from the food. Number 5. Eating genetically modified organisms, foods and grains that are not organic are sprayed with chemical pesticides, which binds to zinc and other minerals, blocking you from absorbing them. Now let's take a look at how you can overcome these issues and boost your zinc level naturally. Number 1. Eat foods rich in zinc on a regular basis like oysters, crab meat, beef, lamb organ meats, watermelon seeds and sugar free dark chocolate. Be sure to choose organic produce whenever you can as these have a higher nutritional profile and will not contain any chemicals that can block zinc absorption. Number 2. Cut back on foods that contain phytates such as wheat, flour, rice, corn, beans and lentils. Get your fiber from leafy vegetables instead like avocados and cabbage. If you are eating seeds or nuts, soak them in water for 24 to 48 hours to germinate them and then dry them out and eat them to remove any phytic acid. Number 3. Start drinking 1 tablespoon apple cider vinegar mixed in a glass of water before each meal. This helps your stomach to digest and absorb more zinc, magnesium, copper and other minerals by strengthening its pH. Number 4. If you are taking a zinc supplement, you should also be taking copper in the blend of other trace minerals. Too much zinc can deplete copper and vice versa. Number 5. If you have had any digestive surgery in the past, liver gallbladder issues or suffer from indigestion, start taking a good quality probiotic which contains at least 100 billion CFUs. This helps to boost the friendly bacteria in your gut so that you can absorb more nutrients to promote healing of the digestive tract. Thank you so much for watching my video today and as always I wish you great health, wealth and happiness. Until the next time, take care and bye bye.